which has really worked its way into our lexicon, is stacking. They've stacked momentum each time out, not only on offense. Between those touchdowns, defense held, forced a punt to get the ball back, and they've played awfully well in this one. Both sides playing at optimum level. Extra point by Gay is up and good. And it's now 14 to nothing. A drive there of just four plays. And it was Cam Akers who capped it off with a touchdown. Following the touchdown, here's Gay to kick it away. And this will be a touchback. Berrios deciding not to bring it out. Back onto the field come the New York Jets for their second drive. They've been outplayed early, no question. Down 14-0 already as they come up first and 10. White. He gets it underneath to Hall. And he's taken down, but able to slip across the 35. A quick first down pickup. Good start after going three and out on their opening drive. On first and 10, it's Hall. And he is met at the line of scrimmage, and he goes down right there. No gain on the play. It'll be second down. 14-0 the score. This is the NFL on EA Sports. Here's second and ten. Now White. Over the middle and complete to Wilson. And they're able to work this across midfield to the 48. And that's a more than acceptable read right there because it's zone coverage, so timing is everything. This time he waits for his man to come open, puts it right on him, and they pick up a first down. On first down, it's White. Open man here is Conklin. And he'll be taken down, but not before they work this to the 45. Got to give credit where it's due. Really nice defense on that play. The pitch and catch was successful, but not any run after it. To throw again on second down. White. And that is knocked away in the middle of the field and incomplete. To this point, I've been impressed with the work defensively. They have not allowed a lot of receivers to run free. And there's another example, another incompletion. the shotgun here's white and that's going to be incomplete the contact there enough to jar that ball free and it brings up fourth down on fourth down punt coming from Braden man and problem spreading to the punt team now this one goes all the way into the end zone on the fly so that'll come back to the 20. cam Akers in the rams offense ready to go back to work he's over 40 yards here in the second quarter been nice and effective for them hasn't he he has definitely been dependable and really shouldn't underestimate what he's getting done here because anytime you're on a pace that's going to approach 100 yards you've really done some damage in an nfl game and now he's looking just to add to his totals Stafford on first down. And that's going to be incomplete. Too tough to hold on to that one. It's second down. And I think they'd be well served to take that type of a physical approach against him the rest of the game. He's had his way so far. But on that last one, that worked quite well for the defense. Stafford's throw, it's complete into the hands of Higby. And he's got it past the 30 before he's hit and dropped. Fifth catch of the afternoon, and that gives him a first down. Throwing is Stafford, rolling to his right. 
Open man, Higby, the tight end. And they've got it well across midfield, down to the 40 before it's all said and done. Throwing again to Stafford, eluding the pressure right. And this will be incomplete. Physical play on the football there, and it's second down. No, no surprise there. He was looking for one of his favorite targets again as soon as he left the pocket. But the coverage was good downfield. They got right to the receiver and helped prevent that completion. Uh, able to force him out of the pocket right, but still able to complete it. And he's going to be taken down right at the 10-yard line. They'll toss this right side to Cam Akers. And he's going to take this one in for a Rams touchdown. Cam Akers on his way to a monster game. Three first-half touchdowns. And the Rams have moved out in front by three touchdowns. So what a first half that he has had running the football. That now three touchdown runs. And I would anticipate that when they get down in the red zone, He's going to get more chances as this game goes on. And I think that the guys blocking for him are going to ask for him to get more chances. They like the rhythm they've developed. Extra point by Gay is up and good. And that makes the score 21 to zip. After the touchdown, it's Gay to kick this one away. And this will be a touchback. Berrios deciding not to bring it out. The New York set to take the field. Well, CD, you kind of feel like they're in a bit of a danger zone right here because now you're down three scores. And I know we're in the first half, but the way this offense hasn't been able to generate anything, you feel like they probably need to get something going on this drive, right? Yeah, and sometimes I overuse that this is an important possession. But I think this has to be the possession where they come up with an answer because only a few teams in league history have ever come back from a four-score deficit. And if they don't score here, that's what they could be facing the next time they get the ball. That'll give them eight that time. And they'll be left with second and a couple. And we've hit the two-minute mark in this first half of action. Here's a second and two now from the 33. Off play action, here's White. And the Rams got him. They bring him down. They're going to need to get up and set in a hurry. White looks to throw. And that is incomplete. Well, this first half has not gone according to plan so far offensively, or even defensively for that matter. They could use a big-time spark somewhere. But it's not going to come on this drive as they have to punt this one away. Here's Powell on the return. And he is out of bounds right around the 34. A good return there, 17 yards. And the Rams will go on offense here with the first and 10. The offense for Los Angeles returns to the field. And now consider the lead. The question is, how much is good enough? Are you going for more? It's the NFL. There's never enough, I believe, because they get reeled in all the time when you sit on the ball. I think that they will try and move the ball downfield and try and squeeze a few more points out of this first half. They'll be careful. They'll be a little bit cautious at times. There he goes, right side. Pass him this. Touchdown, L.A. Cam Akers on his way to a historic performance. Four first-half touchdowns. And the Rams continue to pull away here in this first half. I know I should keep the focus in the spotlight on the hero that just scored, but tackling's been an issue for this defense all game long. I can't set that aside. We just saw it again here. Missed tackles leads to his long touchdown run. Extra point by Gay is up and good. And it is 28-0. Following the touchdown, here's Gay to kick it away. And this will be a touchback. Berrios deciding not to bring it out. Now the Jet offense about to take over as they head out onto the field. 
And Charles, we'll see what they can do here. Not a ton of time left, but enough certainly to get points out of this drive. And they need them right now because they're trailing. Yeah, this is exactly why you practice a two-minute drill all through camp and at least one practice each week before a game. A minute left, more than enough time to string a few complete. Trying to fit it into more, but it's intercepted. And the Rams are going to take possession of the football. So a nice play defensively by the rookie coming up with the INT. And that's a late round pick right there, making a first round impact. And a lot of these day three corners end up winding up on special teams and sub packages and even on the practice squad. But he's really made an impact on this defense and he comes up with the interception there. On the counter, this is Akers. And that'll hurt the average a bit, as this time they're able to get him behind the line. So the opening play of the drive goes backwards. Now they'll come up on second and 12. From the gun, here's Stafford. And they're going to get this down to about the 17-yard line here. The Rams going to go ahead and use the first of their timeouts as they'll stop it with 27 seconds remaining here in the second quarter. They'll need five on this play to move the sticks. Stafford now to throw. Flush to his right. Oh, hit as he throws there, incomplete. They certainly had good starting field position on that drive, but couldn't do anything with it after three plays. Have to admit that that's a disappointing end to excellent field position. When that drive started, they had six points that they were thinking about. Escaping the pressure right. Throw right side, going to be caught by Higby. Now another timeout called for by the offense. So that means they're down to one remaining here as we head toward halftime. A chance to really cap off a big first half here as they come up on first and goal. They'll run here with Akers. And he'll get into the end zone. Touchdown, Rams. Cam Akers as the first half is winding down. And the Rams would extend their lead here just before halftime. Extra point by Gay is up and good. And a route is on here in this first half. So not much time to speak of remaining in this first half as the kick's away. And not wanting to risk anything here late in the half, he'll just take a knee and they'll bring the football out to the 25. Jets offense coming up now to start their next drive. And with time quickly fading here in the second quarter, not sure how aggressively, offensively, they want to play this. I think we'll find out just how much they trust their guys in this situation if they decide to take a shot. The all-everything defensive tackle, Aaron Donald, the one who made the play there. So we've reached halftime here in what is quickly turning into quite a rally as we are off to Orlando now to check in with Jonathan Coachman at our EA Sports Halftime Report. Coach? Okay, Brandon, thanks very much. Back to you guys in a bit. But first, we welcome everyone to our EA Sports Halftime Report. This one, maybe not the hard-fought battle many had hoped for. This has been blowout city thus far, but still more football to be played. Who knows what could happen? as we send you right back out to Brandon God. All right, Coach, thank you, and we welcome everyone back for quarter number three. 